wake up, wake up. Gotta get this paper, get this cake up. Hello guys, welcome back to my YouTube. If you're new here, thank you so much for dropping by. If you are returning subscriber again, thank you so much for subscribing and keep watching my videos. So I've had this question for a while. We some some few ladies text me and ask me how I do lay my edges. So this video is all about the edges. So there are so many ways of doing your edges. Uh, I had me I use my brush. I have actually two types of brushes, and there's one that I've seen people using for spoolie. I had using a spoolie is usually so nice, especially when you're having braids. And as for me, I already have braids on, so though I still use the toothbrush but i'm here to try this pulley and see how it goes yeah so these are very simple routine and it's gonna be a bit short because i'm just gonna concentrate on laying edges there's so many out people out here you know people ask what's the importance of edges you have you seen ladies with edges like i don't know they just make your they just make you they just make you pop look at me right now with no I still look nice, I mean, but when I lay my edges, it's going to maybe change my look. I'm going to look a bit more alive, a bit more prettier. I don't know, there's just something about the edges. But the moment I do, and I do, I lay my edges, they, I just look nice. It looks nice. So I had the best way of laying your edges when you have braids is using a spoolie. I had that on TikTok. Uh, I have this one this this was my toothbrush but i don't like it because it was like hurting my teeth so i just decided to make it my edges i've used it for a while this one i usually use it mostly when i'm with my natural hair because it's a bit big and thick so i just brush it all in with my hair you know how the girls do their hair and hold it as a bun that's what i was doing with this so for my braids i keep using this because it's a bit tiny yeah, and I'm yet I want to try to use a spoolie and see if it works nicely on braids. So yeah, let's get straight into the video. So I'm gonna start first and foremost by like kushi leote nyuma. So that I'm left with only the edges to deal with. As in nyole and I'm gonna bring you guys a bit closer. I can zoom. Yeah, but I think that's close enough. Mm, so for my gel, I do use this Echo Gel, Echo Styler. I got it for, mm, how's the price tag? It's at 950. I've not used it yet because my other gel finished. So we got this and there are a lot of people using gel in the house. Me, my mom, <laughs> my boyfriend uses once in a while. We wanted to test if uh, his hair can, he has curly hair. But wanted to test if he can use gel and make it like more kalia. I don't know if that makes sense or if that's a word. Yeah, so we're gonna try with this pulley for today. I had I've told you guys that the this pulley works magic, but we are here to try. Yeah, so let me get a mirror. It's gonna be like a short video for my ladies who so i'm gonna put it on my hair because i already have makeup on it's usually nice to do your edges before doing your makeup because of the foundation but this is for you guys so mm. Ooh. they say using a spool is much more so I'm gonna first start to start by brushing it. And then I think I'm gonna use you guys as my mirror because mine near pod, so I have to hold it, but now I have to hold also my hair. So this is how we do it. Hold and then brush the rest in there. Huh? Hmm. 
so guys how's the difference between this side and this side you see it's a bit i don't know there's just something about these edges that makes us look so good so so right now i'm just trying to concentrate it on the hair part because i already have my makeup on i don't want to spoil it you guys are busy wondering why i have makeup on you don't even want to know what time it is i'm not even leaving the house just to make some tiktok oh i think this pulley works nice best if you have braids i can totally agree it's a bit so easy see that brown thing it's the foundation so like i feel like you should i do my edges before doing even my eyebrows so i first do my edges and then as the funga they dry as they dry i do my eyebrows and then after i'm done with the eyebrows i remove and then from there it's when i use the oh so what you do with the edges after you're done that's not it you have to funica you can use any kitamba for right now i'm using a bandana because i don't i rarely use them so let me take you guys where you belong so yeah you have to funica it you can use your bandana so you put it like this oh this is i think this ban ban bandana of mine is a bit dirty because i use it you see it has some brown things so it's my gel so when i find a heavy you can dry it and then put it on the edge oh where you've chorad hold it tight so that it dries there's some people who use the blow dry to dry if you're in a hurry so as for me so i usually do this first so as it's drying um i go to the eyebrows and stuff yeah so let's wait i'm gonna see you guys when it dries so guys it's been five minutes for this one it dries real quick so it's been five minutes i think i'm okay just also dab it in yeah and then gonna release then see the magic see there's a difference guys my hair looks so much better and i also look a bit much better so see i told you guys i did my edges before i did my edges after doing my makeup but since i just finished doing my makeup i was thinking of just brushing through it mm. putting some powder let me So that see it's a bit red it's a bit there's some color missing so yeah mm. yeah and that's our final look guys hope this one has helped someone out there to know to make your edges and yeah they they have such a huge difference my hair looks like freshly done i'm a week old but it's like two months old so oh, yeah hope you like this video please give it a big thumbs up if you enjoyed it and if you learned something comment down below yeah and i guess i'll see you guys next time and for the for the gel you can use any gel that you prefer according to your also your budget there are some gel at 200 shillings and yeah this one is just that it's so huge that's why it goes for 900 but yeah, yeah the other gel for like 200 shilling very affordable so guys let's play on a budget let's play together all through and i guess i'll see you guys next week bye thank you all for the support i love you guys bye